All right, well, I finally made it. We should have crossed the street. That's the bus driver. But yeah. 20, 30, wow. <laughs> Trying to see if I remember where this facility is at. I think I might have been down here before. I think I've been down here before. I don't remember being over here though. Uh, again. You know, you don't remember a lot of things. This is a TI. You know, being hit with microwave radio with frequency weapons. You know, your memory, even your long-term memory is affected, but not as much as your short-term memory. You know, this is why they're constantly doing things to test my memory. All right, this is, again, they know what, this, these, what these things are. And the fact that what they've done to your, to your mind. Oh, sh ooh, ooh, almost fell. Right? And what they've done to your mind, they know that they cannot repair it. So they gotta create certain type of criteria to make it seem as if they haven't uh, damaged it. Right? Right? Of course she's standing there. You know, look at that. Look at that, KDT 3229. Hey, they always gotta position cars exactly where it needs to be, right? But anyhow, this is what they do. This is what they engage in. And, uh, you know, like I said, I keep exposing it. But yeah, you know, anyway, uh, the, 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 the Negropian female standing in the sidewalk there, you know, with that colorful hair, you know, one of Pam's friends have the same kind of color hair and they always got to find people that look alike to try to send some type of subliminal message, right? Yeah, I'll expose that even more. Talk to you guys in the next video.